Let's try it again. Okay, insulation on board doesn't work. Okay, that sucks. But that's just the basic uh, thingy, um, how you go ahead and uh, install uh, new firmwares. This time it didn't work with this one, but this was a, you know an alpha bill. Um, so that's um, acceptable. Uh, but uh, if you want to go ahead and try out, you know, you know, Cyanogen mod, you know, install that firmware, you can go ahead and do so. I may do that as well. Uh, but right now I'm looking for an ice cream sandwich 4.0 build uh, that is better than my Alpha 7. Now I tried a new one here and that one didn't work. But if you have any links to a better you know, alpha belt or you know, ice cream sandwich. Uh, please let me know because it would be fun to try out. This time, though, it didn't work, and that's life. Sometimes it doesn't work. Uh, but uh, yeah, so awesome, guys. See. Hey guys, so found this quick workaround uh, kind of firmware that I'm gonna use called Cyanogi Mod uh, for my Samsung Galaxy S2. I was trying this, you know, alpha build and it was kind of weird. Now it's Cyanogi Mod, that's like something that, you know, uh, it's like the best uh, firmware out there. It's available for a ton of devices, so I'm just gonna go ahead and, uh, uh, you know, just get uh, Cyanogi Mod to have this beautiful website. Uh, view all supported devices. You can just go ahead and go and see if your phone is available right here. Um, so I mean, you know, my Samsung Galaxy S2. You just click on stable mode, download the latest um, CM7. They are currently working on CM9, I think, or something like that. Uh, but go ahead and download that. Should have something like this on your desktop, and I'm just going to go ahead and. Uh, connect my Samsung Galaxy S2 um, just like that so I could transfer it to my phone by using you know USB because obviously we need a firmware on our phone so I'm just gonna wait here uh, until it pops up Let's see here. Okay, that's weird. Uh, it's being called removable disk. Okay, weird. Okay, so I'm just gonna uh, move it over, zip file to the root of my um, kind of phone there. Okay, so there we go, only 100 megabytes. So, now I'm basically just going to go ahead and uh, take my Samsung Galaxy S2 here and uh, reboot it. And I experiment a lot, you know. You don't have to do this, you don't have to watch these videos, you know, it's cool! You don't have to, but you know, it's cool if you want to as well. Because I think this is fun to try out new firmwares and stuff like that. Should remove cable. Okay. So here we are again. So I'm just gonna do the same thing as I did in that other or same video maybe. Um, by just going to go ahead and go to mounts and storage and then I'm just going to format um, system formatting system okay there we go and then I'm just going to format cache
done. I'm just going to go ahead and go and format data. Okay, there we go. So now we should just go ahead and go back and go ahead and go down to install zip from SD card. Choose zip from SD card. Uh, hit the up key to go to the bottom. Uh, and then you just go ahead and try this one out. Okay. Install. Go down. Not sure how long time this is gonna take, but yeah. Hopefully, I won't get an error um, like on that alpha thingy. But this is, you know, a stable uh, mod for this device, so I don't think we're gonna get any issues here actually. Okay, there we go. You can see uh, install update, install from SD card complete.